so I was just chilling at the GE, and there was this guy, and he came up to me and was saying, uh, do you want some money, do you want to play this simple game, it's quick, and you get a lot of money, but I instantly knew it was a scam, it was some kind of candle scam, he was calling it the wall lure or something, but it's all the same thing, I guess, so, but I know the scam since, like, five years ago, so, I know the ins and outs, you know. So I went on another account and I went to the same area where you play the game and I decided to look for a way that I maybe could outsmart this guy or something, maybe make a little, uh, a couple mils, you know. So what I found out is you just have to bring a second candle, a lit candle, because I'll, I'll explain later in the video why, uh, why, why it has to be lit. And uh, he may not see the second candle, so I always drop it before uh, before the trade. Otherwise, he will say, uh, "Why did you bring it? Are you trying to add scam me or something?" You know. So yeah, he's just trading and fucking around with the tinder box. Yeah, you give then. So now you see, I, I light the second candle, I give it back. Now I have two lit candles, yeah? That's very important. You have to have two candles to anti-lure this shit, okay? It's pretty simple once you get the first time down. It's it's uh, not, 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 not much to it. Here's a lot of talking. His English is not so good, but I can't. My English is even worse. So yeah, I don't give a shit. And he was saying that I could get like 35 mil for this. So I was like, yeah, why not, man? 35 mil. I, I was bored, actually. I was bored. I don't I didn't want to do any PVMing today. I was like, yeah, I'm tired. You can hear my voice. So yeah. Here he's walking to the place where the lure is actually. Uh, yeah. So make sure when you are here that you have two lit candles. It's very important. It's the only way you can anti-lure this. You have to have two lit candles. Then it says, come here, stand against the table, uh, drop your items. Um, and what you have to do is you have to drop all your items and drop the candle just one of them because if you drop a candle that's lit on the ground the room stays lit i'll show it in the video as well it's it's i, I didn't i don't even know how i found this out but it's kind of logic to me i guess if a candle is on the ground it will stay lit for the room i guess i don't know so here i will drop my items the cash and i drop one lit candle then i come up to him and I sell one of the candles for 35 mil. And that's actually, that's all that, that is to it. But make sure the candle you're dropping on the ground is a lit one. So here I'm, I'm just I'm dropping, I guess. I don't know why it's taking me so long. Oh yeah. It's pretty annoying that it has a warning, but yeah, it's not really in my favor. So here I drop the lit candle, I come up to him, I unlight the candle, yeah, it's very important, you have to drop the lit candle, go up to him, and light, uh, unlight the candle and sell him the candle for 35 mil. Or you can get more, but you have to be lucky, I guess. <laughs> it's so stupid, man. <laughs> he didn't realize I had a second candle because I, I just dropped it. And now in this part of the video, I'll just, I'll just show you what happens if you don't bring a second candle, if you're not aware that this is a scam. Look, it's just you drop the cash. I'm not going to drop it because I'm, I'm, I'm acting like it's real. So you get, then you come up to him, 
you unlight the candle and boom your items are gone